All right, let's get to the main story, <laughs> shall we? Yeah. <laughs> okay. This is fun. This is exciting. This is good. Keemstar knew he was about to get roasted today because he tweeted at me <laughs> this morning or last night or something when we made the event. Uh -huh. Can you send me that link? He keeps trying to get me to box him. I'm I like, did we drop it in there already? If not, I'll, 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 or I'll highlight it. it for me. Yeah, I'll get it. <clears throat> yeah, so it came out. And I actually learned this from Trisha. So Trisha made this spinoff of Frenemies called Enemies. Mm -hmm. And in her latest one, she uh, attacked Keemstar for dating a 20-year-old. And I was like, spicy. What? Well, I didn't know. I didn't know that was a thing. Because you're not <laughs> following his life? No, I don't. <laughs> Just send it in Discord. Maybe I should be following his life. Though, no, I think you're fine. Good. I think you're right. fine. <laughs> so here, this is what he, he sent me, knowing that we were about to... To yeah. talk about his uh, his new daughter, I mean uh, girlfriend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he's angry. I didn't even say anything yet. Box me, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean the guy's been exercising and lose a little weight, and he wants to fight everyone. Bro, you have the mentality of a of an eighteen year old. It's obvious by the people you're dating. I'm just we not hate interested. Keemstar. Actually, um. You know what? This comes as a little bit of a surprise, but um, Keemstar actually just joined the Zoom call. I think he maybe wants to comment on this. He oh, did. he wants to get ahead of the story? Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm going to bring him in. Uh, I, hopefully, he can keep it brief. We shouldn't let him in, dude. No? I, whatever. I mean, go ahead. Well, it's, fa it's just fair to It's fair him for him to, ahead, to be able to say his piece. Bring him on. Let's bring him on. Go ahead, Ian. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Okay, <laughs> calm down. <laughs> Oh my god. All right, cut him off. Cut him off. Yeah, he's, he's out of control. control. I told you. He's out of control. He's, angry. he's very fuck, angry. Man? I'm sorry. I didn't even have a chance to respond to that. Box me, bitch. Very angry. So, what was Trisha's? I didn't actually watch Trisha's. Should I watch her take on it first? What did she say, basically? Um, so, she was just talking about uh, the fact that, like you said, the age. Um, I have a summary. Give me a second. Uh, the power play that does exist, even if she isn't a fan, because Keem claims that she is not a fan, his girlfriend. The power dynamic. Yeah, what I say? Well, power apparently play. they met at oh. a fan meetup. Imagine that. Uh, yeah. He's 39 years old, by the way. <laughs> 39. And he met her at a fan meetup. This it's guy like a is... Romeo Juliet. Yeah, it's a, it's a real Romeo and Julia. So anyway, situation. she trashed him, and we started looking into it. Um, and here is, what is this? Oh, this is his response to Trisha. So here you go. Let's give everyone their uh, fair shake here. Trisha Trash Paytas. You're unbelievable, Trisha. You're absolutely unbelievable. Uh, let me explain to everyone, all right? Recently on Mom's Base... You know what I just realized looking at him? I think his beard is longer than his shins. Like, if you zoom out and see his legs on the floor, because I think he's like 5'2". His beard is longer than his actual shins. What Box shins? Me, bitch. From his knee to his feet. His beard is longer. That's impossible. <laughs> I think so. I think if you zoom out, you would see that. Banks, Faze Banks, was asking me about, you know, my single life. And I was like, well, I'm starting to date this girl. You know, she happens to be 20. I'm having the time of my life. Da, 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 da. He's like asking me all these. I finally met someone that meets my, <laughs> that matches my maturity level. <laughs> this is how I found out about this, by the way. I saw this video. And... Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, I don't know how I met so I had no idea that, like, he's, like, revealing it in this moment. I was just like, wait, <laughs> what did he just say? Yeah. So there, there's a whole lot more coming. This is just great. These fucking questions, and I'm just talking about it. And I'm, I'm, you guys see me. I'm glowing. I'm having the time of my life. I'm so happy, right? I'm in a very, very good place in life. Everything is fucking golden. <laughs> Trisha Paytas decides to upload a video today. Such a midlife crisis vibe right now. Totally. I guess he had like a year-long girlfriend that he's with for a while. I don't. I can never figure out if he, the girlfriend was the mom of his daughter or not. No, I think she was not. Right. Oh. But they had been I together so. for a while. Huh. Only speculating. Wait, he's yeah. posting picture of his girl? I think so. That. Two hours ago. No fucking way. Hold on, I gotta pull the. I gotta show. <laughs> I, I, 
I shouldn't show you her. You shouldn't, yeah. It's, it's on his Twitter. I know, but let's just not draw. Okay. All right, go to You really the crossed the line. She, she's going through enough. Yeah, exactly. By being with mm -hmm. him. And let's say this. I, I let's make this clear up front. Don't go. Don't try and find out who the girl is. Don't I try not, and do anything. The girl anything. is not to blame for anything. Yeah. yeah. The girl is only 20 years old. She's a child. Yes. We love Iron Man. Well, I don't know anything about her, but I'm not going after her at all. I was never going to criticize her or say anything bad about her. This is just about a 39-year-old creep preying on a young girl. Yes. All right. Um, I'm busted. <clears throat> you are definitely busted. Self-report. <laughs> <clears throat> um, but I'm just surprised he keeps posting pictures of her so soon. I agree. Cause, cause it's weird. It's on his Twitter, so I was like, well, I want to see this, but okay, you're fair he, enough. He, he mentions in his podcast that he doesn't want to post pictures of her because he doesn't want her to get hate, so he, I guess he changed his, already, mind. his mind. Yeah, yeah. Days. Anyway. I hate that he's saying that I'm going to ruin this girl. I'm going to emotionally scar her forever. Fair point. Saying that the reason why. Although, to be fair, that's probably true regardless of age. But fair point. Girls date older men is because are, they have daddy saying, issues. Like um, all this fucked sorry, up. Sorry. Go ahead. Because you said she's a child. T technically, twenty is not a child. I know. Okay. Let's just all I'm saying agree. It's, it, I'm because not, that's all it's the not comments illegal. now. We're not saying. Yeah. It, Obviously, she's of legal age. They can do whatever they want. But we're allowed to have an opinion about it. Yeah, and especially when. My opinion. It's pretty creepy. Yeah. Obviously, it happens. He's not the first guy to date a young girl. Yeah, it happens all the time. I love that shit. I watch it on TV all the time. <laughs> it's my favorite reality shows. But their relationships <laughs> are very interesting, usually. Yeah, it, and it says a lot more about him than right. about her. And that's, yeah, that's yeah. Clear. No criticism to her. You're right. right, and that was He's a good a point. He's a 20-year-old. She sees this rich, successful, famous guy. She apparently doesn't know much about him. And, like, fine, for her, it's a new experience, but he's the guy that needs to know better. Go ahead, A.B. No, I said, yeah, Trisha made that point, too. She made a good point. She said, there's something wrong with Keem if he's compatible with a 20-year-old. So. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah, I think it's important. We keep emphasizing not, this is not a criticism of the girl. <clears throat> it is only and forever a criticism of Keem Star. Where, where is this coming from, Trisha? I can tell you where it's coming from. Your life, uh -oh. you, uh -oh. because you've told the entire internet when you were younger, you would date older guys for fucking money. All right. These things don't relate. These things don't relate at all. My girl's got her own job. All right. She's got her own money. She has a great relationship with everybody in her family, including her father. Like not everyone is you. He's buddies Maybe with you're the father, emotionally actually, scarred for what? Him and the father, they get along great. They're right there. Yeah, they're perfect. They're actually really yeah, close. Yeah, they went to age. high school together. Yeah, <laughs> they're old for buddies. <laughs> when she's done eating uh, dinner with the family, she goes on to her, to, over to Keemstar's to uh, eat, um, I don't want to say, I was going to say eat his salad, but that's not nice. You know what eating the salad is, Hila? No, and I don't want to know. Okay. Yeah. What you did like, oh, when you were salad? Young. Yeah, eating. Yeah, oh, same thing. Uh, you eat the salad. Younger in your twenties, dating these older men for money or whatever. I get that. All right, you had a bad relationship with your father. I get that. My girl doesn't. Your experience is completely different than than my experience. It's just so insane. So I'm like sitting here, like, where is this fucking coming from? Where is this actually coming from? I'm like trying to piece it all together, and like you're trying to like insinuate that I'm a fucking pedo. We got screenshots. Nobody's saying he's a pedo. Stop it, Kingstar. You're such a stretcher. Well, we haven't listened to what she actually says, have we? Well, you're right. Just I have. saying. Did she insinuate he's a pedo? I. Uh, that sounds like no. She's she 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 Olivia's shaking her head. Olivia. Oh, yeah, she, yeah. I don't yeah. think. Actually, you know what? I think we're all acknowledging she's 20, so clearly not a pedo. He's the one that likes to falsely. Call people. Yeah, yeah. I mean, he's a yeah. Confused, yeah. Actually, <laughs> a good point. Than, yeah, so. good point. But I think he's just making this epic stretch just so he can tr bring up this next point. He deleted her photo apparently. Oh, he saying. did. Yeah, good call, dude. Weirdo. Why don't you take a seat right over there? Oh no, I, I still see it, but, but I. But he know. goes. I mean, just again, not a criticism of the girl, but he goes. The photo is his girl and like his Ferrari or some super Corvette. Nice, Corvette, nice sports car. Anyway, he goes, she's not interested in my money, and then tweets a picture of her in, her in his Corvette. Which, by the way, she may not well be, but he's putting that out there, not her. 
something that Cameron pointed out to me is Corvette's a really small car, and the angle of the photo is uh, kind of funny. <laughs> I'm just going to say that. What does that mean? <laughs> Wait, go back to that photo. He's. He, oh, you think she's taller than him? Well, everybody's taller than him. I'm just saying, he's the, yeah. Whoever <laughs> took this photo, if it was him, was really close to the ground zone. Oh, 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 you're 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 drawing some kind of conclusion by how low he's the camera he's is. Triangulating the angle. You're triangulating. The, uh, yeah, he looks about five three, maybe four <laughs> nine even. Good luck, A B, because you're gonna fucking need it. <laughs> what? Okay, thank you, A B. We no got problem. screenshots. Hopefully, he doesn't come after my wife actually again. Actually, trying to hit on minors for years. We got video proof of this happening. What are you saying, the girl? I'm yeah, this is classic Kim Star tactics. He goes, "You're criticizing me in any way? Well, then I'm gonna go to instantly go to the most insane place I can and threaten you never to talk about me." He he is uh, the worst, and he continues <laughs> and will always be the worst. You know. If I have to pick size, I will always go against Keemstar. He's the worst person that is and will ever exist on YouTube, period. I'm seeing is literally 20. Legal. What? Yeah, no, but she's legal. The final point that I would like to make is the entire internet has seen it, all right? You want this Keemstar cock, all right? You have tried to get my fucking cock for years. And it was very insulting, right? So I, I was in a relationship with a girlfriend, and you still tried to fuck me forever. I'm not interested. I don't find you fucking attractive, all right? On the outside or the inside. Not happening, Trisha. Interesting theory. Glad he uh, made that clear. So anyway, there's a whole war going on between them, which I'm not going to lie, is pretty... Is pretty fun for me to watch from the sidelines but you know there we started looking at all this and then keemstar actually keem um i know he kind of flipped out but he he messaged me he said he he said he wants to talk and he'll be calmer this time he, he's back on the zoom why do we okay mm. i just want to be fair to him like you know we've been dealing with ryan kavanaugh and lawsuits and you're supposed to give equal size to both right so bring him on all right and bring let's him on get, let's yeah, see what he has to say i was screaming still Keemstar, Keemstar, you're going to have to calm down if you want to talk. Okay, Keemstar. All right. All right, cut him off. Cut him off. I don't know why I believed him. Jeez. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's my fault. I'm He's sorry. clearly not any calmer than the last time. You want this Keemstar cock. I guarantee I don't want that. He is really amped up, man. He is angry. By the way, can I, I'm going to show this one because it's just her back, but it's really about the caption. He posted this, Hila. Look at the caption. He, she said, legit, he posted this with this caption. He said, she plays Minecraft. Am I going to jail? Hell yeah! Hell yeah! <laughs> what does that mean? But that she's a kid? Yeah. <laughs> he's joking about the fact that she's a child. He elaborates more on the whole Minecraft thing on his podcast. Which we're going to get into. Apparently... <laughs> no! Apparently, this clip of him talking about his relationship with his 20-year-old Minecraft-playing girl is... Oh, wow. We have a custom thumbnail here? What is this? Oh, is this just... <laughs> I asked Cam to whip something up. <laughs> Friar, Faze, and... Blanks. Is, is he taking a dump on his shoulder? Yeah. Yeah. That, sure. that appears to be what's going on right there. I didn't even look at it yet. At this point, you should thing. just turn it. Okay, so here is Keemstar talking about uh, him and his girlfriend. And I've, told, I've been told that this entire clip is just pure, absolute spun gold from Brumpelstiltskin's <laughs> maids himself. Just pure spun gold. Now, before we watch this, I guess we should talk about the fact that, uh, <clears throat> something to bear in mind, he has an 11-year-old daughter. His daughter is closer to age to his girlfriend than he is by about double. Oof. Uh, and another, just to put it in context, Keemstar was or had already screamed the N word on Xbox Live by the time his girlfriend was born. Interestingly, <laughs> how about that in context? That's some good context. So really paints a picture of the timeline. Yeah, she didn't even exist. He was screaming N words on Xbox Live before she even existed, bro. I mean that that's mm -hmm. that's a lot of history. Mm -hmm. I'm in a sea of slander and lies. And this is all factual, buddy. <laughs> into a fucking you just should turn it into keem park i am that's i think th i think that's what i'm gonna do you should, like you should build a fucking paintball 
Fucking He's talking about his yard. Fucking paintball. <laughs> this leads into it. it it'll yeah. make sense in a second. I just can't even get over how dumb Faze blank sounds. <laughs> you got the fucking paintball. I'm King infinitely Park. smarter than you and um, infinitely more successful than you. Nope. Dude, Dude, you're, you're wrong. wrong. What's happening? I just said, looks like you're wrong. Okay. He's infinitely smarter than you. Right. Acres, am I tripping or is that like a dumb amount of land? That's a dumb amount of land. Like, there's a lot of space, and it's all connected it. right to my property. I'm thinking about, you know, I was thinking about, like, up on the hill. Like, there's, like, a hill. Did I just hear him go, oh. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. There's going to be a lot of great he noises throughout like, this. Like, I guess I'm not one to to, to yeah, that's complain true. that's that happened cough a lot. <laughs> but I don't true. usually go do that right in the mouth where I go, oh. <laughs> Mm. Well, you do. I don't think. Really? But okay. All right. Maybe I shouldn't say anything. Just trying to keep you honest. All right. Fair enough. <laughs> I can see from my house, right? And I own the entire hill, and there's a field there. I'm thinking about converting that field into a campground and having oh, cabins. cabins. Yeah, that's tight. Yeah, Why, is yeah. There, is there I, like woods and shit, and like lakes back. Hold up the fucking phone. I didn't even get to the girlfriend part, and I'm already floored. He wants to turn his house. The land around his house into a camp zone in Buffalo, New York, by the way. The last place anyone's going. <laughs> well, you'll see why. Why does he want fans to come camp around his house? That's just odd. Yeah, well. It, oh, it, yeah, it, dude. Woods. There's creeks. See. There's all kinds of shit. And I'm going to be making trails all through the woods. And then also, the, this one hill, uh, Banks, is filled with maple trees. And the sun hits it just perfectly. And it's perfect for maple syrup. So I'll be able to tap all these uh, maple trees and gravity. And what, what you do is you tap the tree and you plug it into a like a, a tube, a blue tube, and that There's tube will run down the hill. Now. And so you don't have to collect the buckets or anything. Like literally the sap will run out of the tree into the tube all the way down to what is called a sugar shanty. And you take 40 sugar gallons. Shanty. That's my literally sugar shanty. You take 40 <laughs> gallons of maple sap, right, and you boil it down to one gallon of pure Keemstar maple syrup, and I'm going to sell Keemstar maple syrup in, in the next couple of years. I'm so excited for that. I fuck, I back that. I mean, 230 that will years, not happen. is that like, could you build like a fucking like, you should build like a, um, what is it, like a go-kart course? Huh? People are saying he's making a new Neverland ranch for young girls. <laughs> it certainly sounds like it. Oh, boy. Come on, yeah. <laughs> of course, 18 plus girls. Yeah. Yeah. Come get some keen maple syrup, boy. Oh, it's a winter wonderland up here in Buffalo, New York. We got maple syrup and f what? Some, I guess that's it. <laughs> and dirt bikes. You can ride in my Corvette. On it too and shit, like random crazy shit. Throw a fucking Dude. Ferris wheel in that bitch. Or like All types of stuff. Shut up, you dumbass. Dude, how much this girl. Does that, how much oh, does a roller coaster oh. cost? Like, Shut like, up. Like, you are not asking me this question. This girl that I was hanging out that I'm hanging out with, like, literally asked me the same thing. She's like, "You should build a roller coaster." She goes, "How much does a roller coaster cost?" Literally well, what, the same. What, what, I just sign, had this bro, conversation. Sign. It's almost like they're intellectually on the same level. Yeah, I guess so. <laughs> It's almost like a 20-year-old is thinking of these questions. Can you imagine the safety regulations? Can you imagine the implication of Keemstar owning and operating a roller coaster? New chick, your new chick that you're fucking with. Mm. We gotta talk about that too, man. Good job. What's Banks. going on? Yeah, with dude. That? You're, That's you, got, wild. You, you didn't. You didn't fucking miss a beat. Shout out you're to already, Banks. You're already sure diving in some new cheeks. <laughs> You won't be shut Yeah, out. I started hanging out with this. <laughs> he said, yeah. I started this hanging out with right, bro. I go I go sorry, before we get into all that, I just Googled it. An average roller coaster costs from Oh, sorry to break I just Googled the age of consent in New York and you're good, bro. <laughs> so we can talk about this. One to two million dollars minimum? It says in bold letters minimum. There's no I, fucking way, bro. Yeah, but, dude. Wait, are they seriously think, say, trying to say that roller coasters are not expensive to build and operate? Please don't build a roller coaster. Like, please. Think about it. A couple crypto punk sales? Bro, we could have a roller coaster. Facts, bro. <laughs> facts. Facts. No, but wait. What about those fucking, like, janky, like, like, I'm talking about, like, maybe not, like. A dude, you know we don't care about the roller coaster. Talk about the girl. <laughs> Fucking Six Flags Superman roller coaster, but like one of those like like what 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 about oh my god I seen, and shit. I seen I seen people like make their own roller coaster, like literally oh. make their own roller coaster at, at their house with no engine, where it's just you like you push it up a hill and it just goes around in a circle or whatever. 
Like you can definitely do it. Like it's For it's cheaper. doable. Yeah. It's finally here. Untold stories. Top moments from worlds. Brings the fuck is that? It's an ad. It's their ad. They're just like integrated into the episode. Mm. So just skip forward like thirty seconds. Legends World Championship. What the hell is this shit? Top moments from worlds. Cheeks, man. How's how's that? How's that feel? How long has it been since you fucking since you dove in some new cheeks? Uh, okay, yeah, you're talking about a 20 year old, first of all. <laughs> how long has it been since you dove into some new cheeks? New cheeks. New che how fucking some new cheeks, bro? <laughs> no, but I'm but I'm saying before that. Uh, yeah. So I was in a relationship for fire. like 13 years. So yeah. Wow. Did you wrap it up? Uh, well, yeah, of course. Uh, so I don't know. Wait, I started hanging you? out. Wait, what do you mean? I don't know what you're asking. Did you did you put a condom on? Of course. What do you mean? <laughs> I don't no. know, man. That's <laughs> <laughs> so yes or no. You did it, dude. Bro, you stop asking. Bro, you, bro, you can't, can't ask bro, these you questions. Can't dive in. You can't listen, bro. You can't. You can't. You can't fucking. You. Let After me tell you something. Time, bro, you can't ruin it with a fucking condom, bro. <laughs> listen, don't, guys, listen to me at home. Don't listen to what I'm saying right now. I'm a fucking idiot. <laughs> don't listen to what I'm saying. I don't even know if you're asking new or the old or like what. What are you referring to? The new girl. Oh no, no, I'm good, the dirtbag. Good man. Ew, that's disgusting. So you're saying he's not. He did using... not use a condom. Jeez. I mean, I don't know if she's on birth control. I don't know the details, but once again, it's like you're 40. You're like the you're supposed to be the mature person. Like, damn, she's she's a young girl. Like, wrap your be like be the responsible person. Yeah, and birth control is not going to help if he uh, he has some kind of STD. I'm not saying he does, but oh. better be safe, especially with someone like Keem. Did you bring condoms? Actually, what I heard is Keemstar's semen just burns the burns right through your uterus <laughs> like acid, like battery <laughs> acid. So it could actually just kill her. I heard his semen could just kill her dead. Yeah! <laughs> like alien? You remember alien saliva? Yeah, of course. So that's kind yeah, of like, like what... Yeah, it just burns through the, yeah, the ground kind of when it drips down. Semen in oh. I mean, dude, this is, this is so sick and fricked. And weird that like he's not using a condom and also why are they even talking about the this? conversation itself like just the way they're like yeah bro bro no you condom. Those cheeks without a condom <laughs> <laughs> ew this is so wrong you guys i hate this stop what is wrong with them you don't even have to think about it dude okay so if i mean even phase is 29 yeah i don't know they, they're talking like they're just turned 18 and they're just Fucking for the first time. You yeah, know? this is the, yeah, exactly. It's like no condom. Oh, <laughs> you raw dog in that shit, my dog. <laughs> it's so nasty. It's like not even middle schooler talk. I don't know what yeah, age I this is. Yeah, I don't know. It talks like this. But it, what's even worse is that they're doing this for public consumption. <laughs> yeah, it's like why did you publish? So like, it? what their private <laughs> conversations got to be even like more like yeah. uh, deprived. Right. Man, good I'm man. a dirtbag. Good man. But no, so I started good hanging man. out with this girl. Good. Wait, wait, wait. Um, Are you serious? Wait, let me go back. The new girl. Oh, no, no. I'm good, a dirtbag. Good man. Good I'm man. I'm a dirt. Faith is in favor right of Keemstar not using a condom. Yeah. On his new 20 year old girlfriend. Good man? Why is he. I I was thinking to myself, okay, let, this is a good test. And to see without if, clarification on if they do any birth control at all. That's what would be a really strong follow-up question. But, Blanks. you know, I, I, I've had my, a thought to myself. I said, this is going to be a good test if FaZe is like a good friend or a decent human being. Is if he is, is trying to give him good advice, like, okay, dude, on the real, you need to not do that. Like, it's not okay to do that. And he says, good man, good man. I mean, these guys are twisted. <laughs> what is wrong with these people? This is sick. This is sick? Her bag. Good man. But no. So <clears throat> I started hanging out with this girl. Um, you this know, is I'm, sick? As everyone knows, I'm like 39. Uh, she is 20. Which I don't feel bad about Nine. at all. Nothing was awkward at all in this situation. Yeah, Everything because you have the mentality of an 18-year-old. Feels totally Wait, normal. She's I, 20 years old? Yeah. 
Where the fuck did you find this girl? You you sick? <laughs> okay, so he didn't know the age. You didn't, know, you didn't even tell me this. This girl's twenty. Okay. Yeah, yeah. What? what even Banks is okay. outraged by that. You know that's twisted. Hey, we. Yeah. Listen, sorry, sorry for cutting off. Go. Just talk. Take the floor. Well, she's she's a she's a waitress, right? Well, whatever. She's a server. Anyhow, we met. We hung out. We've been hanging out. We've been having a lot of fun. All right. And I don't feel awkward about the situation at all because honestly, like, do I act like my own age? No. Like, I'm fucking like 25 for life, pr pretty much. But anyhow, nothing was awkward about the situation whatsoever. Everything's been totally fine. I don't feel like a fucking creep. I know other people are going to judge. I don't really care what you fucking think. But there was this one moment where I did feel like a creep. Like we oh were hanging God. out. We were hanging out. Everything was totally fine. The vibes were like perfect, dude. And she said to me, do you want to play Minecraft? <laughs> Let's go! <laughs> Do you want to play Minecraft? <laughs> and then it struck, and then it's hit me like a be like a ton of bricks. I'm dating a child. He's like, it wasn't awkward at all until I had this harsh realization that I'm dating a 20 year old. <laughs> Damn. Do you want to play Minecraft? That hurt. that hits hard. This guy is f is fucking this poor girl with no condom. You guys. I'm still having trouble uh, in ter uh, with that one there. Did you bring condoms? No. Keemstar did not bring condoms. <laughs> Why don't you take a seat right over there? Apparently he didn't bring condoms, Chris uh, Hansen. Damn. There's no way. There's no I, way. No, she did. No, she did. She wanted to play Minecraft on her phone. And I, like, I was like, wait a minute. Holy shit. Am I being a creep? <laughs> So, does this girl know about what you do on the internet? She must. Good She's question. No, she, to be honest, she really didn't know that much. No. Like, her friend. She's going to be horrified when she much. finds out. But I'm saying that's a good question because if she doesn't know what kind of guy he is on the internet, she, she might want to do some research. You seem pretty confident on the internet. Yeah knows of me type of shit yeah i feel like you're uh, my girlfriend actually didn't know who you were either i feel like you're more tapped into like the hardcore internet like your audience is primarily male i would assume <laughs> yeah, yeah like her friend knows of me like she uh, didn't really yeah. know that much uh about me i don't know we just had vibes like girls looking for the fucking news and and tea are going to these like tea channels like these like yeah. makeup gurus and shit for all this i'm assuming yeah. right yeah no, but it's been it's been um it's been a lot of fun actually. Um so yeah. Damn. Not only do you got some new cheeks, you got some fresh new cheeks. That's crazy. Ew. Ew. I can't fucking believe that. So how'd you meet um, this girl? Uh it's a long story. <laughs> well, we got fucking this time, brother. It's our fucking show. I don't know. This me and Fuzzy. So this is so interesting. So mm -hmm. me and Fuzzy, like, we did a fan meetup, and, fan meet um, <laughs> you know, our friend was like, came to the fucking fan meetup? You met this well, girl at the fan meetup? Hold oh up. There you have it. Uh. <laughs> Keemstar is picking up 20-year-old girls at fan meetups and having sex without condoms. And he's saying she doesn't really know who is he, I, right? He's going to try to cover it up, but I think he self-reported by accident. It's by saying yeah. it was a fan meetup? Mm -hmm. Also, well, he's saying she's guy. a waitress. And then in the response to Trisha, he's like, she's got her own job, she's doing well. It's well, like, I mean, fine, but a waitress is still, like, she's still with you for the money. <laughs> you know? Yeah, I mean, it's, I mean uh, it's very possible. I don't want to make any assumptions about her. Not her, but it's from, a, from his perspective. But it's not like she's, like, established, like, yeah, I, she's, she's and not... Yeah, she doesn't have a career. Yeah, she's not, like, established. She doesn't, like, have a house and she, her own, yes. like... She doesn't own a house and she's shit. She's very much struggling... She's not, for each paycheck, yeah, probably. I can I can assume that being a waiter in Buffalo probably isn't the most comfortable. Uh, I mean, the cost of living is probably pretty low there, though. But yeah, he he's trying to play it up. I mean, look, she's a, I was doing the same thing when I was her age. Me too. You know, except not dating. <laughs> yeah, I'm not saying about her, but waiting is not easy. I mean, shit, give me on a bad day, I might. Go home with Keemstar, you know? Oh, yeah. You know? Any way out of that. <laughs> it way was out of the worst life. job I ever had. Any way out of that life. It's the yeah. worst job. <laughs> yeah, you know, I was listening to a little bit of a side, but an interesting one. 
because I'm sure most many of us have a uh, restaurant experience is that I was listening to the daily, the New York times podcast. And apparently there's this really intense labor shortage right now because of all of the, um, unemployment assistance yeah. that people are, and and restaurant jobs are just so shit especially you know like the kitchen jobs so hard working so little pay that people left um because they got the extra unemployment from the government like the extra mm. 600 dollars a week and nobody wants to go back wow they're like i don't ever want to go back that's and so there's a really intense labor shortages um for for jobs like restaurants huh yeah specifically my uh, brother works at a restaurant. He said of the 20 waiters who were there initially, only four came back. Only after unemployment. That's crazy. Wow. But, the, yeah, the problem is, is that it's just it's the work is too hard and it doesn't pay enough. Mm -hmm. And it's just it's brutal. And especially during COVID, you have to put yourself at risk. Right. Because it's like high traffic. A lot of mm -hmm. people. You know, when I was working in the restaurant, man, like the guys in the kitchen were the hardest working, hottest Fucking grueling, thankless job, making like twelve dollars an hour. You know, it's just intense. So that's interesting little aside there. But uh, anyway, back to Keemstar. Hold up. <laughs> Oh my God. So her her friend was a super fan. <laughs> okay, okay, go, go continue. Her, Sorry. her friend was a super fan, right? And so, like, she came. How does, a, how does like a woman end up being a super fan of Keemstar? That's just a bad road to go down. Like the only people that are allowed to be super fans of Keemstar are like in scale, in cell school shooter kids. That's how I imagine any super fan mm -hmm. of Keemstar. Man, there's always someone. <laughs> For, there's, sure always, there's always someone, someone but. for something. <laughs> Same. And with her friend, right? So the fan meet up just to like be a support, like a, a friend to her friend because her friend didn't want to come alone, right? I guess her friend was like all into me and like, you know, I was messing around talking to her friend or whatever. And then one thing led to another. And I don't know, somehow I ended up with, I don't know. I'm fucking having the time of my life, Banks. What? Who's mm -hmm. a friend? You got is this what happened? It no, I didn't like say any of that. It sounds like you guys you met two two girls at this fucking fan meetup. Yep. And Fousey, you and Fousey, did you, was Fousey there when you guys all kicked it? Oh yeah, yeah, he was definitely there. But I mean, that's his own private shit, and that's for him to say. Like so, like Fuck I got it, bro. Fousey. Does it? Say, is that almost insinuating that Fousey was also smashing fans? Mm-hmm. That's what. That's yeah. That's what he's saying. Like, they're gonna elaborate more, but yeah. So like, dude, they're literally the fan made up purpose is. It sounds like the whole purpose of this fan meetup was to meet girls. That's it, fucked this up. Phase is guessing though. Um, we don't know for sure though that about Fousey. Well, I, obviously, I'm I'm trying I'm reading yeah. with yeah I'm making mm -hmm. an assumption based mm -hmm. on Kimster, uh, yeah, not wanting to admit. Dude, these guys are guys are so gross, <laughs> sick fuck. Blew some cheeks out too, a hundred percent. Bro, I wasn't born yesterday. I've been in the game for a minute. That's what happened. You guys kicked it with these girls. Right. Pussy hopped on the friend, and you got the you got the fucking Minecraft chick. You know how like people say that there's like Bro, a power no di way. <laughs> You know how people say that there's like a power dynamic and like don't take advantage of your fans and all mm -hmm. this other shit. They sell all this stuff right. online. Right. Like, um she she's not a fan, just so you know. <laughs> you met her at a fan meetup. Dude. That it could there's there couldn't be more epitome of a of a power dynamic. Especially being a forty-year-old dating a twenty-year-old. That's and where you have and money they, and she's working. When you're the one and there's a group of people and they all came just to meet you to admire the great king and take a picture with you. I have and my been fan, my my friend days. loves you. She's obsessed with you. Yeah, her best friend is obsessed with you. There's no power dynamic. What do you mean? <laughs> God, he's so deluded. How, the fact that he's even talking you know, about this. You know what's funny to me is just if it was someone else, he would be going in so hard at them for this. Yeah, he would be. Calling them a pedo because that's what Kimster does. Yeah, I wouldn't. Would. I'm totally not saying would. that, but he, it's just is, so funny to me because that's what he would do. <laughs> Here, I'm going to try to pretend. What would Kimster say about Kimster right now? Kimster is a fucking pedo he's going making fan events to meet fans to take advantage of young girls and he's having sex with them and he's not even using a condom this man is a predator and a yeah. pedo is he on the phone by the way 
Uh, I have him in the lobby. I wasn't going to let him in, but uh, it, do you want to hear if he has any response to any of this? Yeah, that's a pretty damning accusation. Let's hear what he has to say. All right. Bring him in. <laughs> oh, shit. He's still screaming. <laughs> Teamstar, you're going to have to... <laughs> you're going to have to calm down. All right, cut him off. Get him out of here. You're going to... Mm. It's just, uh, he can't keep it together. Very kind of misogynistic, too, while we're speaking about women, to call us whores. It's unnecessary. Yeah, he's the king of misogyny. Yeah. <laughs> I guess that's a good segue into that conversation. Um, I mean, there's a huge difference, right? Like, between, like, taking advantage of someone. I mean, if, if everything's consensual, there's really no issue. She's of age and everything's no consensual. That's yeah, we've been been like you said, Banks, nice, fresh cheeks to clap. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's been a lot of fun. I'm now, if you're dude, fucking like, she, you know what I mean? If you're like fucking with the girl and this and that, it's like it's different. But it sounds like you guys are having fun. And you guys met cheeks. completely like on good terms and everything's good. Um, nice try. Do you do? you know me, dude. We're, we're real people. He's like, oh shit. We said. He's like, just to be safe. Yeah, let's just say much. that. Should I keep listening to this? Or is there more good stuff? It, it's never ending. It honestly, I mean, it's up to you. It, the whole thing. You guys want me? Do, should I keep listening? I mean, there's like another solid like seven minutes left, so. I, I mean, I'm entertained. I think you should. Yeah. Yeah. You <laughs> want this team star cock? You guys want more team star? I mean, it's I love. I it. mean, it continues I to be for, outrageous. I throughout. live for this shit, so. <laughs> I don't know if I just keep going. If people are into it or if they want something else. You have tried to get my fucking cock for years. Okay. <laughs> Keemstar, I am not interested in you sexually. We're waiting for the comments to come in. Uh, kind I of see a lot actually. of move on. Keep, yeah, I mean, we're going to have to do a poll, actually. We're going to have to do a poll because it's very mixed in the yeah, chat. Yeah, let's do a poll. Uh, I've seen a lot. <laughs> now really... I see more yeses. Yes, no, yes, no, no, yes, yes. I, the, it's going to be hard to tell without doing a poll. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that seems pretty mixed. This is interesting. Let's see. I'll take this opportunity to go to the bathroom. Can you go to the bathroom for me? I'll try. Let's get that, uh, that get awesome that waiting up, music. Ian? Yeah, I did. Hmm. Yeah. Thank you. Uh, oh, AB, you set it up? Okay, here. <coughs> Oh my god, the chat's moving so fast. All right, Keemstar, yes or okay, no. Okay, hold on, hold yes on. Everybody, no. everybody, hold on. Yes okay, I just no. pinned the straw poll. It, it's pinned in the chat because it's All going right. way too fast to uh, actually... Let's see here. There's some good stuff coming up. Let me open this. There's some good stuff coming up. I'm voting yes. I'm, I'm yeah, in it. me too. Okay, we got... <laughs> oh god, it's crashing. Oh my goodness, it is close. Yeah. Should... Wait, it's only 300 uh, votes in, though. Mine, okay. I'm seeing about 800. Here, let me refresh. Wow, wait, this is... Um, you it's guys. really split. Wait, I'm seeing the no's winning. But the it's worded, should we move on? Yes or no? Oh, wait. Oh, that's confusing. Who move? Should we move on? No. You. That's worded so confusing, you guys. It's not that confusing. Should we move should on? Should we keep watching? Yes or no? No. Okay. It makes sense. I mean, it makes sense. <laughs> it totally makes Should sense. Should we move on? No. Okay, but then, okay, so wow, this is close. This is close. This is scarily close here. Looks like by a narrow margin, the keep continue watching wins. By a very narrow margin. This is one of the closest polls we've ever conducted. Yeah, it's about 52 to 48 is the uh, split that I'm seeing. Wow, 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 wow. So the keep goings uh, have the it. Keep goings have it. We have it by a hair. We won by a hair. Keep watching. Won by a hair, Ela. Show off your show off your jumpsuit. You look so cool, dude. You look like you need a samurai sword or some shit. Work it. Or like a mechanic work, work, in your work. car. Kind of vibe. Mechanic. Hot mechanic vibes. Twirl. Hot mechanic. The Dickies Thank jumpsuit. We Ladies and gentlemen, the Dickies jumpsuit. Thank you very much. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Oh, 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 and the kicks. You just dropped Let's the go. kicks on me? Yeah, you know. Damn, you had to really do it to me, huh? If you ask. You made me feel small when you did that. <laughs> dropped Damn. the shoe right in my face. That was your feet, Ethan. <laughs> Ethan's so funny. Yeah. What's funny about this? <laughs> I the, love Teddy Keep that fashion it, music going. Let's go. It's just... <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> Teddy Fresh. Teddy Fresh. 
Teddy Fresh socks, Teddy Fresh shoes. I'm representing the nation. I'm here to support you 100% always. TeddyFresh.com. What, you don't like my outfit? I thought it was a cool outfit. No, the only thing is just like the color coordination. The, the neon socks. Yeah, I mean, the socks are a stretch. Really I, look, sock. I look for better socks, but I have to wear Teddy Fresh. So this is the best <laughs> thing I had. Like, you got to make brown or cream colored socks if you want me to match. Okay. It's on you. All right. I always do that. I, say, I always tell is... Ethan, you know, you don't have to wear Teddy Fresh only. Blasphemy. But he doesn't want to. I says, I says Eva, if I'm not going to go out every day dressed in Teddy Fresh, how can we expect anybody else to? Okay. You have to live your own product. By the way, I'm starting to not be able to wear it so much because I gotta wear things that are like maternity friendly. Mechanic, pregnant <laughs> mechanic vibes. I'm going through a phase where I'm trying to figure out what's my, what am I wearing? It's well, not it's good, easy. Well, it's good though you've already been through it because you, I think you can recycle. I was, but I don't like what I wore last time. You, you're not going to. This, um, this, last time I wore this like maternity jeans. Mm -hmm. But this time I can't. I don't know why. I'm not the jeans, into bad it. vibes. Yeah. Well, I like you. Could should just keep getting bigger mechanics. So it gets bigger <laughs> and bigger and bigger. Be cool. But I wonder if other people go through this because for me it was like I would totally before just wear jeans like every day. But as soon as I became pregnant, immediately they didn't fit me. Like other people can almost not see any change, but my clothes don't fit me anymore you know like it's just it doesn't surprise me i mean you're yeah. three months or over three months now now yes no but even in the beginning which is a big deal by the way guys the first trimester is like where there's usually complications so <laughs> right it's great it's great that we're kind of out of the woods in that regard so high five high five proud of you <laughs> thank you it's still weird i still don't not really feeling that you're pregnant you know what i mean I know. Like, I'm still not really understanding that we're about to have another baby. Yeah. Before we move on, can I just compliment you guys on this shirt? I l absolutely love Thank the material you. of this. Cool. It's made of French Terry. It's, it's on the not website. Not French Terry. It's Terry. <laughs> oh, just Terry. Oh, French Terry is something else. Sorry. French Terry is different. Yeah, give us a twirl here. This is made from Terry. It's <laughs> on the website now, teddyfresh.com. It is uh, beautiful. It's got, it comes with a flower pen. You want to show the flower pen? Work it. So That's we, I had, um, I had a sample of this shirt, and when show I, AB, show AB. When I put it on, I decided to put the a flower pin on it, and I came to work like that, and they were like, "Oh my god, we should add that to the shirt." And I was like, "Totally." So cool. Uh, the pants are, the shorts are also TeddyFresh.com. Uh, corduroy, nice. What do you, how do you review the shorts there, AB? I love the shorts, especially mm -hmm. because of like just the always the quality of Teddy Fresh. Like mm -hmm. sincerely, I'm not just trying to sell. Go ahead. Like really, like I always drop shit on my other pockets or mm -hmm. fall down. These are set to go. You put them on and they're not falling. Good to go. Thank you. Not loose fit. Good quality. Don't wrinkle easy. Try. Love hit it. it. Hit it. Try. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. That's what I'm saying. You gotta live it. You gotta love it. Um. Anyway, back to Keemstar. <laughs> yeah, actually, he's on the phone again. Um, let's give it one more shot. This is this is your last chance, Keem. Uh, if you can't keep it together, then we're just gonna have to move on. So, here, bring him in. Fuck! He's still Dude, <laughs> has he stopped screaming? Keemstar, stop screaming! Keemstar, stop screaming if you want to talk. He's so angry. Keemstar, Just bitch! Keemstar, he's got to stop screaming. Just Keem, bitch! Keem, we want to talk, we want to engage with you, we want to hear your side of the story. Keemstar, if you want to talk... I mean, that's his side. That's his that's side? That's the live stream right now. He's still... How? I don't want to hear him. Fuck you, Keem. <laughs> right. Hang up, hang up, hang up. I guess... I, I'm sorry. Shut up, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> well, we've heard his side of the story. We can say that confidently. There's all these people spamming that the poll was rigged. And the poll was not rigged. I well, don't know what that means. Wait, it won't, wait, are they saying that it should have lost? I mean, what, do you, what did they want? I believe they're saying it should have been written differently. Yes, it should have been written differently. I'm okay to conduct it again. All right, do it again. Like, like hairbrain. I have another it's one ready. A, what, is a, what is the no, reading comprehension of you people? It was written confusing. I'm should we you. move on? Let me see. No, because it's no, so when you vote no, it means yes, keep watching. It's confusing. Right, it is confusing. It, all it's right. It's right. written. Right. It should, I have made it super clear this time. So go ahead. Should we keep watching? Watching the video, okay. yes or okay. no? I already right, made it. Go. You, I'm gonna I pin agree. the old one. 
It's it's very here comes it. In the meantime, I'm gonna read this comment here that comes. she said. I just realized Eli and I are both around the same week of pregnancy. I just found out I'm having a boy. Is your due date in February? It is. It is in February. I haven't found out the gender yet. Yeah, how did you find out but, the um, gender? But congrats jealous. to you. That's so exciting. Good luck. We love yeah, you. We luck. love mommies. <laughs> Team mommies. Okay, I put up the new poll. The initial results, they're almost exactly the same, Okay, guys. well, calm down, Dan. We're going to get the new results here. Click the, <laughs> show the uh, poll here. Here, I'll put it on the, okay. the screen. Okay, so, well, it's actually way more in favor of watching this time. How, do, how can you say that's similar? Last Just time it was like a two-point spread. This election this was like, a fraud. But it's, the people that were saying it was rigged were the ones that lost last time. And now Locked they're just losing by an even wider margin. We well, filtered the idiots. No, I'm playing. God bless you guys. Yeah, but I think, lot, I think a lot of people who wanted, I think a lot of people that wanted to watch just said yes. Okay, well. But then yes means move on. All right, well, we've, we've, we, have a more, we have a more decisive uh, decision Thank here. You. More Keem. So, we all like right. to troll. Let's push more on. with the friar and the gnome. We do a little trolling. It's called we do a little trolling. You remember the cartoon <laughs> David the gnome? <laughs> I'm getting David the Gnome vibes, like Friar and the Gnome. It's awesome. <laughs> Two, you know what I'm saying? How the fuck? How the fuck is um? How the fuck is Justin Bieber supposed to supposed to date somebody if he if he like is he supposed to just shut the Justin Bieber thing off? Oh, so Kim Star is right. equivalent to Justin Bieber. <laughs> Baby, I wasn't trying. <laughs> All right. <laughs> okay. Well, you know. <laughs> well, usually I would say Justin Bieber, being that famous, he probably dates other people that are celebrities. And the proof is he does. He does, actually. He doesn't go date, like, normal people he meets at <laughs> fan meetups, for sure. That's so true. The thing is, celebrity, like, first of all, Kim Star's not a celebrity. Let's tone it down. Yeah. And second of all, yeah, usually celebrities like Justin Bieber will date other celebrities. Because they have stuff in common, unlike with a 20-year-old when you're 40. You want this The girl, she knows he's Justin Bieber. Girls are attracted to fucking success and... And a cool lifestyle and shit, and you know what I mean. That's part of. Actually, like, it had nothing to do with that. It's just like uh -huh. it's the beard, dude. You know. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sure, I'm no, sure I mean, don't every, every girl appreciates a dude who isn't a fucking bum at the end of the day. But true. Uh, no, I mean they're trying to backtrack so hard right now. <laughs> yeah, team's god crazy. gift to one. So so but I was, I was worried. Fucking with. No. Um. So no there, I was worried about. <laughs> What do you You're mean? An Dude, I, I've never seen this side of you. I thought you did because I've known you. You've had a girlfriend. I've true. never seen this side of you. But you know, I got game. Remember when we went into the he fucking? Has game? Into that? I got game. Keemstar thinks let's, he has game. Let's hear his yeah, story. I, let's I hear his guarantee story. Keemstar doesn't have game. That's also, impossible. How long was his last relationship? Yeah, I think he said it was. 13 he mentioned it was years. thirteen years. So let's hear the story that he has to share. Oh, so evidence of infidelity. Hmm. <gasps> Holy shit! Maybe oh, my video God. game game uh that party in L no we went to a club in la right well, and leo a dicaprio person, man like you know what i mean people yeah. people like enjoy talking to you and enjoy being around you oh yeah remember when we went to that club in la <laughs> what? the party wait what <laughs> life we're the talking party. about the same person <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you and your ex-girlfriend Alyssa Violet Rice Gum. We were we went we had a table. Leonardo DiCaprio was like right next to us. Two Chains was fucking playing in the club. You remember that night? Oh yeah, I do. I actually do remember that. Yeah. And I like snagged that girl like real quick. <laughs> you know, like yeah. Do you yeah, remember yeah. that? Huh. You I, know, I, like I don't know. I, I got don't know. So, so, had a so girlfriend for thirteen years. So Keemstar <laughs> in a desperate <laughs> attempt to convince people he has game has basically admitted to cheating on his girlfriend. Wow. And even Faze Banks is not even impressed. He's like, what a dumb loser. What an insecure piece little man he is. <laughs> but also, can you imagine Leonardo DiCaprio at a restaurant with rice gum, Keemstar, and Faze? That's what he said. Man, all I can't imagine <laughs> That's what he said, is who's right next to Leonardo DiCaprio. The other people are saying, how, we're never coming back here, yeah. whatever <laughs> this is. They're like, wow, this place is back trashier than I thought. Crap. <laughs> Game? I remember the night. I don't remember all the all the intricate details of the night. I was. I, I imagine we were all fucking drunk. Did we all go back to our house after? I think so. I didn't do anything with this girl, anyways. Anyways, because like I don't. Know. So what is it exactly you're bragging about? Your game pulled this girl, but he didn't do anything with this her. This is all backtracking. I think they keep admitting to stuff and then backtracking. It's yeah. all <laughs> like oh shit. What did I just say? No, no. It's amazing. I mean, this is 17 minutes of pure spun gold. It really is. <laughs>
Yeah, she. I'm not a scumbag. I was just talking to her. Uh huh. Yeah, she was just on you. She was just trying. She was trying to buy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I don't know this this current girl that I've been hanging out with, dude. She had a, like a back injury. Like she was like seriously like something was wrong with her back. The She's back a injury server. from you. No, it was something completely different. But <laughs> you listen, blew her back it, out. Keem blew this girl's back <laughs> out. No, listen, no. Uh, the, the story's like kind of similar to that. So anyhow, something was wrong huh? with her back. Like one of her vertebrae was like fucked up or something, and she was her back was killing her for like an entire week. Dude, she came over here. We were hanging out. I fixed her back, dude. Did you? Yeah, dead ass. Mm-hmm. Very proud of that moment. So um, what? what does that mean? Up? I had a discussion with Dan about this. It's like a Romeo and Juliet. He fixed her back by slamming her. He 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 has the, the sex ma- was just so good that uh, that it it fixed her fixed back. Her back. Oh my God. He has that the magic stick. Team Starcock. Oh my God. <laughs> this. Oh sorry. Yeah, there's a sound in the background, like one of these middle school. Yeah. Team yeah. So Star-Cock. who was doing that? Was it him? I think He's like Star was doing that. I fixed it her back. <laughs> Yeah, it could have been phased. It's hard oh to know. Oh, my God. Team star cock. Dude, I get it. You're having sex. Like, dude, I mean, grow the fuck up. Like, holy shit. This whole conversation is so juvenile, pathetic. Oh, my God. <laughs> Does she want you discussing all this, even? I mean, because this is out there forever for her now. Yeah. Like, she's going to be the girl that fucked Keemstar and got, and then everybody talked about their sex life. He fixed your back with her last night how many times have you hung out with her shit i don't know i've been hanging out with her a lot oh Oh, man has she met your daughter i bet they have a lot in common (laughs) is she is there there something is it just you it could be fun or no way you're saying it could be my fucking mind is blown right (laughs) my mind is fucking blown Wait, I'm going to send you a text message. <laughs> just real quick. Just just tell me what you think. All right. Um, We can cut this dead part out. It's fine. No, Too late. no <laughs> you need the live reaction. Okay. All right. I don't know if I'm prepared, bro, for whatever you're about to find. Trying so hard to show how cool <laughs> really he is. Don't. What? He's trying so hard to show how cool he is. He doesn't right. want them to cut it. He wants to get the reaction. Yeah. And... It may be that he shows Faze. Well, let's just, yeah. let's see, let's just hear yeah, what draw, it is. I'll draw, I'll draw a conclusion. You can draw your own conclusion. I got your t- threat. Oh, my God. Keem, are you fucking serious? I'm dead serious. <laughs> I'm dead serious. I took her for a ride out in the ATV and shit. You I don't fuck. know. We've been having fun. This girl's got a nice butt. Okay, so he, he definitely showed her some kind of provocative photo of her. Which, which... Maybe. Every, any time, I've been around dudes who show me, they're like talking about their girl, they're like, yeah, here, check this out. This happened to me several times from guys, and they show me a picture of her like nude or something. Really? And I just, I find that the sleazy, it's like, that's so your girl. Girl. You don't have to, con- what do you care what I think if she's hot or not? Yeah. Like, and, and you're so desperate for my approval that you're compromising her privacy and like just objectifying her in the most disturbing way. Um, I find it so, dist- it makes me so uncomfortable and it's so gross every time yeah. guys have done that to me. And I'm 90% sure that's obvious. That's just what happened. I mean, there's no other way to describe right. that moment. Gross. I don't know what level of compromising, but um, he definitely showed some kind of compromising photo of her. I know. <laughs> this is fucked up. This is crazy. Did you? Did you? T- did you fuck her in the mudding thing? No, no. We showered first, but like, you see those boots? Yeah. You see those little dude, boots, the little fucking, chickens. Dude, this girl's pretty, Keeb. I know. This girl's really fucking pretty. I know. I'm not gonna lie. I was sitting here thinking Keem might be like, you know what I mean, just fresh off the single life, like, like maybe settling for a little 20 year old fucking street rat beater. This girl's fucking. This girl's pretty. Holy what? shit. Street rat beater. Street rat? <laughs> street rat beater. Oh my god. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, Team if Faze didn't have money, he would be unfuckable. So he's <laughs> funny for him. <laughs> yeah, and the photo he sent was from a text message. So most likely it was meant to be just for Keem to see. Well, of mm-hmm. course it was based yeah. on Banks' mm-hmm. reaction. 
Dude, she's like, she's like fucking so cool. Like, I literally have so much fun with this girl. I don't Bro, know. Maybe I would fuck this girl. <laughs> maybe start with that. Start this with how crazy. fun she is. Instead of, uh, I fucked her here and there. and Yeah. Banks, the highest compliment I can pay your girl is I would fuck I would this fuck girl. I would fuck this girl. <laughs> Jesus. Dude, these guys are like Neanderthals. They're not even like fully evolved humans. Blanks. Yeah. Actually, an animal game. Honestly, listen, listen I gotta agree. Give, I gotta give you the credit. Ten out of ten, good shit, bro. Honestly, I've never seen this side of keep. I'm genuinely blown away by this. I came what do on, you guys, mean, guys? I came on. You guys gotta. Understand, I came on. I'm like, Kim. We really need a fucking guest. Like, whatever. He's like, Nah, bro. Trust me. We're good. I got. I got some shit I want to talk about. <laughs> I got some shit. He's like, we'll talk about your crypto punk sale or whatever. We got we got shit to talk about. This is fucking crazy. I'm, si I'm sitting here listening to this like what? Like on the edge of my fucking seat. This is crazy. This is not dude, she's in the she's in the back room trying to be quiet right now because I'm doing a podcast. Just, she's oh, like she's here there. right now. Just to give you just to give you just to give you some like I saved I just saved these two pictures to send to Toph. To be like, yo, look at this new chick that fucking look at this new chick that Wait, he saved the photos and sent it to someone else? Yes. Wow. Like... Wow, man. You really crossed the line. Send that to Vin Diesel. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Man. Dude, these guys are such pieces wow. of shit. And let's, let's not even forget that Keemstar says he's having sex with her without a condom, and FaZe said, good on you, bro. Fucking with. <laughs> like, like, that's where my fucking head's at right now. That's crazy. I don't know. We would just have to ask you, ask you her name, but I definitely don't want to, like, not on here. We'll talk about it. That's crazy. Yeah, like, I, I, I guess. I, talk, I, wanna, I don't know. Dude, I've been telling her, I was like, listen, like, I don't, like, just don't follow me online. Like, yeah, I can't, like, post dude, pictures no, of you online. Dude, 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 she's got to get, she's got to, yeah, don't, she doesn't want that. She doesn't really know anything about me, like, online. She, like, really yeah, doesn't yeah. know who the fuck she says at all. And I've been trying to explain Okay, to her. so let's like, see how long it's going like, to last. I play a bad character, right? I'm, like, fucking evil Keemstar. I'm an asshole, right? If the internet finds out who you are, they're going to try to they're harass the fuck harass out of you. you. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. He's, well, his fans will. Really, yeah. his, his fans will. Well, that's, well the, what's, that's what's implicit there. Mm, well, right. well, regardless of who it is, he's already posting tons of pictures of her knowing that that would happen to her. So I don't, I just, I don't get his thing. Well, I get, not I think he's John's, just, he's he posted so, one. No, 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 he's posted more than one. He's posted two. He did? Yeah. Uh, at least that I know. Of, oh, yeah, we saw, we saw another But the one. thing is, like, <laughs> he's so desperate, he's so insecure and desperate for validation from people that he's actually posting her photo knowing that she's gonna get shit pretty amazing he understands everybody like the average person thinks they get oh whatever a couple comments whatever but no there's some sick fucks out there bro who like go and like try to figure out there's where sick fucks in that room you guys are recording people do that bro like <laughs> yeah I, I I tried to explain to her what swatting was, and she was so dumbfounded. She's like, "Why yeah, are you swatting? Yeah, let me tell you about what I do on the weekend, baby. <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you about the thing that I like to do with people I don't like. <laughs> What's swatting? Okay, sweetheart. Well, pick up the phone. I'll show you. <laughs> Let's do our first swatting together. That's Kim Star's idea of a first date. People do that. Like, I'm Star like, yes, dude. You people don't people do that. Did I you do that. In the dune buggy. Uh, no, oh, I mean, uh, no, no. You got hit no. in the dune buggy. I know what that looks like. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is crazy. Man, You're out here talk. living like a rock star, building fucking uh, roller coasters in your backyard. Where you're up, uh, bro. <laughs> I'm selling fucking crypto punks for a fucking for a bag. You're catching fucking. You're, you're catching new new cheeks. This is great, man. Uh, dude, you don't understand. New the internet's cheeks. been talking mad shit. Like I've been saying forever. Like if I ever come be get single, like you know. Bro, we're know. in the basement, but we are up, bro. We're in mom's basement, but we are up, Keem. I'm fucking, I'm, I'm happy for you, bro. That's awesome. You sound, you sound happy, too. Dude, this is like, I, I, I guess I didn't realize that I was miserable before. I really didn't realize I, did. I was miserable. <laughs> like, you know me, like, I'm always like, you know, positive, energetic, whatever, or, or like negative, but negative in a way where I'm having fun, right? Yeah. Um, 
Yeah, I guess I was like not happy and I didn't really realize this until like I became single and like, you know, started hanging out with this new girl and I don't know, just I'm fucking happy. I'm on cloud nine right now. I'm having a lot of fun. That's all. That shit is so disturbing, <laughs> man. 